Meanwhile, our second story from Benue has to do with recurrent expenditure. The state government is taking steps to further cut down on the, further, on the over 7 billion Naira monthly wage bill, which Governor Samuel Otom describes as the highest within the North Central region. Governor Tom, while inaugurating another salary verification committee after the initial staff audit of 2015, charged the team to fish out ghost workers who are diverting millions of Naira from the state's coffers. Chairman of the committee speaks on his experience with a group of syndicate who specialize in fixing names of retired and deceased staff names into the payroll for their own profit. At the state level alone, we have a wage bill of over three billion. When you add pension, which is about five hundred and fifty million, and then when you add overheads, it's good to four billion. At the local government level, board teachers and local government staff, we have an average wage bill monthly of over 3.7 billion. So it is a big challenge and we cannot continue in this manner. As you may be aware, our administration is determined to bring positive changes and values in the conduct of government business and we want to plug all leakages that drain the state of its scarce resources, especially finances. We believe that ghost workers cannot simply exist without individuals or groups of individuals who aid or facilitate their existence for pecuniary reasons.